Hi, how y'all doing? It is Tuesday, the 24th, I think, of 2024. Look at that, double 24s. It's the 25th, yesterday was that. So it's Tuesday, the 25th of June, 2024. Here in Ontario, Canada, the skies are cloud covered again with the uh, light rain. They call it light rain. So that's what they forecasted for us. Another mothership. I woke up at what, five to go to the bathroom and it was so bright outside. Right? So bright. It wasn't sun up yet. But it was supposed to be sun up according to outside. Right? I find that strange. <clears throat> but yeah. I guess we'll find out. It could be a giant mothership pulls up over with its lights on it causes the dawn to come earlier or something like that because it's happening all over the realm it is the Schumann yesterday I didn't make a video yesterday I didn't talk pretty much the guy that owns the truck I had to go drive him around right to a couple places and I was just mm-hmm mm-hmm I was not in the mood to, to talk for some reason. It was the energy, right? Even to my son that lives here. I didn't want to talk to him, right? I hardly said any words. My eldest son came over because I asked him to and cracked my back for me. And I think he was feeling the same way because he didn't stay long at all, right? So, did you feel that way yesterday? I believe the Shuma was at 78. I posted it on my community page, my community comments, whatever you want to call it. 78 with an eight hour blackout or something like that. I think I wrote it down. Hang on. Ugh, excuse me. Nine hour blackout. So today is 58 with a five hour blackout. So who knows what the Schumann is right now. But it's a blackout. So it could mean that machine's down. Or, yeah. The energy's at a pause. Right? Something like that. I watched a video with Dr. Greer today. Dr. David Greer. Right? And he was saying a bunch of stuff. It was two hours and something. And uh, it's just newly released. And he was talking pretty much about the disclosure that he's been doing. And as I sat there and I listened to him, even though he says he's spiritual and stuff, right? He's still hiding stuff where he doesn't know everything. Right? So I believe he's uh, taking the minions out because the big guys are already gone, right? And he's working on the minions. He's what they've already been taken out, I believe, because if not, he wouldn't have been able to say all the names he said on YouTube. Because, yeah, guess who owns the internet, folks? They do. The they, right? If they don't want you to have access to the internet or your computer, just a push of a button, metaphorically speaking, and yeah, you don't get to post, you don't, they can, you know, blow up your, your uh, computer. They can, they see all your stored files, everything. Your websites, they're in control of it all. Okay, they made it. You don't think they can look at everything? Come on, right? So, he says he put a data, they put a data, he put a database on his website, right? And uh, if you want to know about the, what did he say, it was 7,000 um, stolen technology inventions, right? That's what he calls them, inventions, although they've been around forever. Um, he's got a list of 7,000 of them on his website you can take a look at, right? And the website is called Seeky, the Seeky Files, this S. C G K I files. So I was thinking about checking it out late, later. 
right? Go to his, what is it, Stephen, or just, well, you'd be able to find it, StephenGreer.com or Disclosure by Stephen Greer. You know, something like that. If you search it, I know if you search for it, you'll find it, right? If you want to know about that stuff. But yeah, the stuff he's talking about is just pretty good, right? Other than there's a lot of fear in it, you know, because he's looking at it as having to take place, right? We're doomed, right? Kind of thing. If this doesn't happen, well, it's already happened. We've already got this. It's just, this is this, this closure coming out, okay? And, oh, guess what, too, that Julian Assange got released and is on his way back, right? So, guess what that's going to be all about? Disclosure, right? About everything, because... He had all the information, and that's why he had to go and run and hide, because they were going to off him, you know? So now he's back. That tells you right there, right? They're all gone. He's got no harm coming to him. So to bring it up for the sleepers. So, hmm. Interesting. Exciting, right? Yeah. Uh, what else did I write down about? Oh, he also admitted that uh, the gray aliens, see, he said the same thing I did, right? That there's real aliens and fake ones. The fake ones are man-made. Like I said, they're severely abnormal people, disabled, whatever, right? And they make wise them and turn them into whatever, aliens to come abduct us. Right, because this is part of their agenda, the fake alien invasion, right? To get everybody to give their power to them so that they can enslave us, you know? But, uh, or enslave us more, whatever. But he said that the greys, the tall greys and all that, right? He said he has a video of one of them having its head smashed and uh, it was all circuits and fiber optics inside androids right everything you are told in the movies is part or has truth in it okay everything so it's just a matter of how you uh, perceive it just like the religion right I was listening to a guy reading the Bible on YouTube the other day right I can only take so much of it even though I perceive it differently and when you know who the real characters and stuff were, it changes the story a whole bunch. You know, it really does. It's amazing. But it bothers me because the people he was reading, he believes it, right? And it was like, oh, man, I can't finish this video, so I had to shut him down. But, yeah, that's to shows you who's, real spe who's really spiritual and who's just faking it, right? The ones that are faking it believe in the God and the Jesus, okay? The real spiritual people know the truth. They don't believe in that shit. So, heads up, okay? Agree with me or disagree with me? You'll find out in the end. I already know. But yeah, believe in what you want. I hate your mama. That's all I wrote down. So yeah, no birds today. And yesterday I just did not want to talk. My energy was really, the energy was really strange, right? I didn't have a need or a want. I sat here for hours actually in, in silent and quiet. I was just flicking around YouTube for a while, just reading headline or titles. Right? I couldn't find anything I wanted to resonate with or anything that resonated with me. So yeah, I spent the day mostly quiet. I guess I needed it. Everything happens for a reason, right? But I feel differently today. That's why I'm making a video and talking to you. Okay? Okay. 
I think that's all I have to say today. How's the Schumann, or how's your uh, ascension symptoms going? Mine are pretty good today. My leg and my foot are tense and swollen, whatever. They bug me, right? For some reason, my left side of my body is growing bigger than my right side, which is strange. But I'll figure it out. i figure it out what or sooner or later I will. And what else? A little bit of discomfort in my spine, on my ribs, but that's because of my spine, it swells up. The side pulls it over on that side, I don't know, it's weird, right? A little bit of pressure in my third eye. Other than that, pretty good. I don't feel, you know, too, too many icky sensations at all today. I didn't have yesterday day either. When I rose though, when I woke up, and the rising today, I was across my bed. I never sleep like that, right? Like, like sideways. My feet were over that side. My head was over on this side. And I was like, how the heck did that happen? My bed wasn't even messy, so I didn't have a restless sleep. Right? So, yeah. Okay. Honor to the ancestors in the storm. I love you all, uh, consciousness. Enjoy this night or day. Okay? Okay. Bye.